So here I am again, uh, a new project for today. Finally, I got my SDR radio down there in my computer and uh, I have an antenna outside tuned for 868. That means, you know, the stick are like 36 centimeter uh, uh, long. And uh, let's fire the software here and let's check the LoRa radio range and uh, what i found uh, the most beacons are between 867.1 to 868.5 megahertz and we have exactly these numbers here okay so let's run it you can see already have one here another one another one another one I don't know what is this. Uh, uh, this is something related to software. Let me try another one. Let's try another software, by the way. This one is having a kind of point in the middle of the screen. I don't know why. Let's go. So, 866. No, we need 867.1. Yeah. 868 perfect so you can see here that's the LoRa range and all everything you see all all this uh, white stuffs are beacons look a really strong one here another one another one so I may say it's a pretty busy activity you know uh, it's a lot of activity I didn't thought that there are not so many hot spots in the area but I can see there are a lot of activity and again it's on maximum that's true but look there 868.1 that's a big one here okay so what I was trying to say is uh, let's check okay two of them very nice let's let's check the let's check the fragrances around oh that, that's a really big one maybe it's mine okay so let's check the fragrances around let's go down here 816 oh my oh my so we are already let me have the gain down like this okay and we are already getting into the troubles here around Oh yes, there we go. It's it's absolutely full screen. So starting with eight hundred and twenty or something, we are getting into the GSM eight hundred and fifty point five. Look there. We are getting to GSM area. Oh, look. And that's a lot of radio frequencies and noises and stuff like this. Okay. I don't want to go farther down. The point is, like, uh, like Sorin said in his uh, videos, all this is noise so this is over how can I say it's it's feeding the amplifier you know it's overloading the amplifier in fact the low noise amplifier without filtering of I don't know but it's pretty strange or pretty disastrous okay we can compare the GSM activity with the LoRa 
beacons they are so uh, small you know like like signal but anyway so let's go higher than 868 73 75 80 91 95 and nothing oh yes here we go 924 and we are getting again into the GSM area and it's a lot a lot of activity here from 961 down to 925 something like this okay let's go back to uh, 868 let's put the gain up And let's have a look to all these beacons we got here. Oh, that's a nice one here. It should be really nice to have our hotspots you know receiving with this kind of gain but for now it's nothing to do I'm gonna try a filter like I said before to see if, if I can uh, if, if I can have a better how can I say uh, reception a better band pass and uh, uh, for now, I don't think it's such a noisy uh, area. I thought it's much more, but it's not. So uh, all the other all the, all the other um, signals are way down, eight hundred and twenty. Oh, look there. So from eight hundred and twenty point eight and up we have to go to 920 something and there we go this these are the gsm uh, transmissions somehow i can say that it's pretty clean it's pretty clean but it's a lot of activity i'm so surprised Okay, so that's it for now. I'll try to uh, to use this uh, radio receiver to test my antennas because now I can have a clear display about the gain, the antenna gain. So there is no more doubt about you know how much it can uh, gain or receive and. Uh, I really hope this is useful. Please like, please subscribe, and the most important thing, don't forget to have fun. See you. Bye-bye.